Hi, Zach here, and welcome to the 13th unit of our Java's Wizards game course. Today what we're going to be doing is creating a heads-up display, so we have a health bar and we can see our ammo, and we can also get affected by the actual enemies as well. So let's go ahead and get right into it. I'm going to go to my game class here, and I'm going to create another public int named HP, and it's going to equal 100. All right, that's all we really need to do. Now, all we have to do is now draw everything. So in our render, and now I'm gonna put this outside of our G2D translate because we don't want it to actually translate in our world. We always want it to be there visible for us. And make sure that it's below our handler.render as well or it'll get caught behind the background. So I'm just gonna go ahead and create the health bar now. So I'm gonna say g.setColor. First, we're gonna create the background of it. So I'm gonna say color.gray. And I'm going to say g.fillrect. And here it's going to be, we'll say 5, 5. The width is going to be 200. And the height's going to be 32. All right, so I can pretty much copy this now. Paste it down for here. And we'll say green. And instead of 200, I'm going to say HP multiplied by 2, which equals 200. And then I'm going to just copy and paste it one more time. And I'm going to put this black. And instead of fill, I'm going to say draw. And this is just going to create a little outline for us. So just like that, we have a health bar in our game. It's really, really simple, actually, the heads-up display. So let's draw the ammo now as well. So I'm going to say g.setColor. I'm going to color dot white, And I'm going to say g.drawString. Oops, g.drawString. And here I'm going to say ammo plus our ammo variable. And we'll say it's at 5 and 50y. So go ahead and run it now. And as you can see, now we have ammo up top. So if we start shooting, our ammo goes down. And if we get a crate, our ammo goes up. Super, super simple. So now let's make it so that when we hit an enemy, our health gets affected. So this should be pretty simple for you. You've been following along meticulously. Here in our collision, I'm just gonna copy this with our crate. This is in the wizards class. I'm going to say if id equals enemy, then game.hp minus minus. And we get rid of this handler.render or remove object. That's all we got to do. So now if we go into the game and we collide, you can see our health is going down. We have like a cool little gray background as well. So you can play around with that as well. And now we're dead. That's pretty much a heads up display.